back again for 51 vlogs and uh, the, the little montage, I guess, before this video. Uh, I wanted to try something new and, and just something new and something different that I try. Uh, but anyway, for this vlog, uh, since last week was April Fool's Day, uh, I thought I'd talk about uh, sense of humor, I guess, and, and it, whether or not uh, I can tell if people are joking. Because I can t uh, pick up on jokes and sarcasm, uh, but only if it's uh, really obvious. It doesn't have to be over the top, but if it just, uh, just, uh, e easy, easy to tell, then I can tell. But if it's more subtle, then, then, I have a hard time I'm uh, telling what it is. And this is mainly just in real life. If I'm watching a movie or a TV show that's a comedy, then I, I know that there's jokes in it, so that, that makes it easier when it's labeled comedy. Yeah, that, that helps. Like this past April Fool's Day, I, I was online and and there was some fake articles on some websites I was on. And I clicked on them and, and they seemed real, like they were supposed to, but still, they, they still seem, uh, uh, unbelievable. And so I actually scrolled down to the comic, comments, uh, on the, the, uh, articles, which you know, I, I never read comments, uh, on any thing, just cause they're just because of people and, and some awful stuff they say. Um, but uh, I did it for these articles, and there are some people uh, uh, who wrote, I hope this is an April Fool's joke. Is this an April Fool's joke? It sounds like one. Stuff like that. And... Then, yeah, then that helped me, like, helped me out, say, uh, and said to me, like, oh, okay, so it could be a joke. And then uh, the next day, those, those articles were labeled April Fools, uh, uh, in the headline, so, yeah. Yeah, they were, but, and yeah, that's one of the aspects for autistic people is the inability to pick up uh, on sarcasm or, or, or jokes. And for me, uh, the one thing, well, the one type I'm not too good on picking up on is, is like if, if it could be real, uh, like, like, um, uh, if someone says, like, no, don't do that, what are you doing? And I'm like, oh, what? Oh, am I not, am I not supposed to do that? And then they're like, no, no, just kidding. Kidding. Just kidding. Like, yeah. Yeah, that, that, that I'm not too good on. Like, 
uh, there's this one situation. Like, I, I was at work, and one of the jobs I was doing was uh, bagging ice. And then I put the ice bags uh, onto a, a, ro- a rolling cart, and then then I, I take them out to the, the uh, freezer outside of the store. Uh, and I was like pull, pulling the cart, and then you know, uh, and I was pulling it past one of my coworkers and. And she, like, she, uh, um, she said, like, ouch, and pulled her foot back, and, like, and I was, I was about ready to apologize to her, but then she says, no, and I'm, I'm just kidding, I'm okay. So, like, yeah, like, stuff like that, that, um, I'm, I'm not good on picking up. I'm bad at picking up jokes, I guess. But it, the more I, exaggerated it is the, the easier it is for me uh, but the ironic thing is that I actually do like deadpan humor the, that type of comedy uh, like uh, I guess uh, one person is a, a is a Bill Murray uh, I like him. I, I, I like his movies. He, even though he, he does a lot of deadpan humor in his movies. I, I guess, like, one of the reasons I like him is, or his deadpan humor is that he does it in, uh, I guess, outlandish situations like in, in Ghostbusters he's busting ghosts or uh, Caddyshack he's at war with a gopher and in Groundhog's Day he's uh, living the same day over and over so I think I uh, I think I actually uh, pick up on the humor better. Uh, or I see the humor since the, the movie plot is so uh, exaggerated. I, I guess I see the humor better uh, coming from uh, him. And I, I have seen his dramas, uh, it, uh, the dramas that, that he's been in, and and I, I don't think I pick up on the comedy, his, his deadpan comedy, uh, I, as much as I, I should. Where did that phrase even come from? Dead pan. I, I don't know. Weird. But for, for me, uh, humor uh, does help. Uh, does help me in, in uh, situations. I, uh, it does make me feel better. So so. Relieves tension, uh, uh, light lightens the mood, and makes me feel uh, like 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 you know nothing bad's happening and everything's okay. I, I think it just helps me overall in the situation because when people are joking, then then. Usually people are having fun, and then it's it's not uh, not serious, and I guess it helps me. Like then I can't screw up things, or or do something uh, uh, 
do something on shell strip wall, I guess. Which, you know, <clears throat> uh, he, he, you can still do that with jokes, like tell a, tell a wrong joke or tell a hateful joke or hurtful joke, which actually I have been in a couple of situations like that. Uh, like there, there's this one guy comes to my store, he just, eh, he's just like not a person I want to be around. He always seems aggressive and really mad and doesn't smile, but, but he, he has talks. I have seen him talk to other coworkers and they might like him or they, they, he seems to get along with them. And, but this one time he, he was leaving the store and, he, uh, like, and, uh, he talks back to me or, well, says to me as he's leaving the store, uh, just let the women do the work, and that's what they're good at. What? That's what he said. So it's like I'm like, whoa, what? No, that's sexist. And, and uh, the the coworkers who were who who were there with me were women, so, like, what? No, that's not a good joke. Yeah, so, yeah, jokes like that, uh, they don't help me. Uh, but, but usually the, the, the humor I've been around is, is a lot lighter and funnier, and so that that just like like I guess uh, breaks the ice, and yeah, br breaks the ice, which which has to happen a lot for me. <laughs> but yeah, d d yeah. So humor overall helps me out and helps really tension breaks the ice and makes me more comfortable. Yeah, that 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 kind of stuff. And yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm running out of stuff to say, so uh so anyway, that's gonna be all for this vlog. And until next video, goodbye.